tuned in. Welcome to this episode of the next 48 hours on DSTV on CTV. And if you're wondering what the vibe and all the action is about, we are at the launch of the brand new Made of SA Springbok Rugby jersey in the V&A waterfront in Cape Town. I'm proudly wearing mine and I'm so excited for you to get your hands on a pair. This shirt was made by 49 pairs of South African hands, proudly made in South Africa and it's incredible to be part of this launch. Now this isn't the only thing in South Africa that we are proud of. The team at the next 48 hours took a route the garden route for a couple of days and explored some of the hidden gems in our very own backyard yeah in the Western Cape take a look at some of these hidden secrets in our province okay the century it started in Pretoria and the century it was just open to safe elephants that they don't have homes and also elephants that they don't have uh, elephants that have got problems as you can see with the jabu as she came into the sanctuary she didn't have a proper trunks like marula we had to teach them we have to put lots of work to let them to teach them how to use their trunks so that if they get into this age as you can see marula she's 19 years old now she knows how to use a trunk so when you get elephants are still young and they've got the problems it's so easier to teach them unlike having a bigger elephants that have a problem it becomes difficult to teach them so the century when it gets open it was just open to save these elephants and also make sure that they learn how to survive and they can survive into the world and they can go back into the world and live their happy life but as the century goes I think the founders they discover that elephants are very friendly and obedient to what people and that's why they came with these programs of educating elephants come ago educating elephants about people well elephants learns about people as well you know so that was the main of the a sanctuary you know If you look at past years ago, people kills down the elephants for their tasks, for ivory marketing, and they always go for elephants with a bigger task for more money. So by doing that, they wipe out the genes. Now they end up leaving elephants with short tasks. You take a look on Marula task. Past years ago, a pair of tusks used to go up to three meters long, and it could weigh up to 90 kilograms to 95 kilograms or even more. But in nowadays, the task that can weigh much is the task that will weigh 60 to 65 kilograms. Now remember now, you look at Marula with a small tusk, and when Marula starts having a baby, if you find a male that has a smaller tusk as well, so there's a chance that the baby might born with short tusks or eventually without, and that is a genetic defect. So it happens with Tandy. She was born without the task it's because of men people that kills down elephant with a bigger task and that is a, a genetic defect eh? she needs them in terms of digging for roots the back in the trees and also protecting herself eh? she needs the task and that's why you look at Tandy and Marula Tandy she's not that easier because she knows very well she doesn't have the task and for her protection you can see she's even talking to me it's all right my girl it's all right Tandy so now elephants that they don't have tusks, they are the one that they tend to be more aggressive because they know very well they don't have tusks to protect themselves. But Tand it's easier for her and she's not that aggressive because of Marula. She's there to protect her and in terms of digging for roots, the back in the trees, Marula is there to look after her. So Tand she's more relaxed elephants because she knows that she gets much from Marula and all the protection that she gets comes from Marula as well. So it's easier to deal with Tandy unlike going into the wild and dealing with her. A wild elephant that doesn't have tusks, they're very aggressive. But in captivity, because these elephants, they've been learned how to live together. And Tandy, she realized that. I mean, she mustn't worry because Marula is there to look after her. Thank you, my girl. <laughs> 